Welcome to Still Plays Galaxy of Heroes. This is Grand Arena. We are still undefeated. This is not going to be different in this matchup. We've got a fairly straightforward one. My opponent has already started. He's dropped three battles against my bounty hunters. It's looking like Grief Karga, even at gear eight, is adding enough to that team defensively where it was a good call to put him on defense. So because he's under stealth, because of that mass assist, because of that cleanse, even here at four stars, gear eight, he's making Bosk a ton better. Especially since now I've taken Django Fett out of that team to put Django with Newt over here, which I don't think he's attacked yet. Yeah, he still hasn't attacked yet. But I'm not expecting too much from his team uh, or from his uh, roster here on defense. For the most part, I should be able to watch through these teams. Again, this is the advantages that happen when you really efficiently develop your roster. Like, I have Relic uh, Darth Revan, Relic Bastila. I've got... Malik, I've got uh, 501st relicked out, uh, not a, not to relic seven, but they all have at least some relics, and I have a massive roster advantage just because I'm constantly managing my top 80 to give me the biggest advantages as possible in Grand Arena. So we're gonna just jump into this. Uh, we'll figure it out as we go along. I, haven't really made a plan. This first round after uh, 3v3, you can't really look at Grand Arena history to see what they're going to put on defense. But, um, you know what? He doesn't have any relics. They're the wrong, they're the all the wrong uh, Galactic Republic. So we're just, we're going to just put in uh, Sith Empire. And play with this one. I'm usually pretty careful about running my Sith Empire against Relict Padme and a correct Padme team, but this time around, we're going to be pretty safe using this team. I should check my feet. All right. Let's see how quickly we can get through this grand arena. Dog this. Yeah, so if you're still in your mid game, like three million, four million GP, and or earlier, like there's so many advantages to pruning your roster and managing your roster early on so that you never get into a disadvantage in Grand Arena. And this is really what I want to be showing with this channel, whereas a lot of the big YouTubers, they have really developed strong rosters, which give you an idea of where you're going to be in the future, but they may not necessarily help you today, right now, against the Grand Arena opponents that you're actually facing. And I'm going up against Grand Arena opponents that, for a roster of mine where I've, I'm at 5.4 GP, even though a lot of that's ship GP, that you can get an idea of how to manage your opponents and your rosters when you're careful about who you gear up and when you gear up characters to gear 12 relics, put Zetas on them. If you, See here. Do I want? I'm gonna hold this team back. 
Well, let's use Jedi Knight Revan. Should be more than enough. I need my bass left faster. See if we can get if we can get this passed around. That should be enough to get at least one protection banner. Let's check out this back wall. Okay, weak shields team. Old Republic team, we don't need to worry about. And only this Kylo team. All right. Those are the risks you run when you have a gear 11 trail. But really for this counter, it's usually more than enough. What? We might be in trouble. Let's 
Spy's the only one we gotta worry about. Well, that was sloppy and unexpected. Before we go too far along, let's just make sure we aren't missing out on anything. So we got fleets, undersized squad, all right, we're fine. We just need to remember to clean that undersized squad's feet after we do one more. Because I missed out on a bunch last time around. shows yeah let's just blow this team up although I might want to keep BB-8 let's see 501st against crew Nuke team, and that leaves me what? CLS. Yeah, we're gonna we're just gonna blow them up. Come on, just take them all on now. Yes. Uh, I've never thought about who it makes sen most sense to give that Arc Trooper turret to. second slot. Oh, 
throw it. So you can understand why this person is even matched up with me is because they have they have a lot of gear 12 and zetas but on characters that don't matter whereas i have a lot of characters i think i have 50 characters or near 50 characters at gear 11. i'm very particular about who gets to move up and that results in favorable matchups all the time. He's going to resist that. Let's see if we can strip some turn. No. He's going to steal some banners. I can feel it. I'm gonna crush this team. This is gonna. It'd be nice to have Tarkin, but I'd rather have the underdog. They're low gear enough where I don't think it's even going to come up.
Let's see if we can slow play this enough to get one more banner. No, it's over. Oops, what I do? <laughs> oh wait, I don't even need these. Let's bring in Spy just in case I really mess up. Jeez. Yeah. All right. Let's see if he's tried attacking yet. close to the top 50 for now. No, that's not what I'm on. Right, I got Fleet Arena to grab later. Okay. Hopefully in the later rounds the algorithm will give me some tougher matchups. This first round was to my advantage. Thank you for watching. This has been Still Plays Galaxy of Heroes. Be safe out there, everyone, and be excellent to each other.